Hey there, my name is Sam, also known as Bakush Kokoi, and welcome back to my channel. Or welcome to my channel for the first time, if you haven't been here before. It's been a long time. It's At least it feels like it's been a long time since I've uploaded the last video here. And a lot's changed since then. Or I guess I'm headed back to square one once again. Before I get into that, um, I forgot to ask my question. Have you drawn this week? If you have, I'm proud of you. And if you haven't, I'm still proud of you. Because life gets really crazy and sometimes we can't do what we want to do. And life got really, really, really crazy. For a bit, at least. It seemed like everything was going wrong. Um, I don't know if you saw... <coughs> Whew! I don't know if you saw the, uh, the community post, but, um, yeah, um, I got hit with the illness, the, the, the big, the bad one. After three years of ducking and dodging and doing everything I could to, to avoid being ill, I got the ill, and I unfortunately spread the ill to my loving and sweet partner, my sweet and loving girlfriend, and that was a terrible time for both of us. I was... I was going through it. I thought it, I thought I felt like I was dying. And thankfully I've been vaccinated and thankfully I, I will do everything I can to keep being so, you know, to keep getting each getting each updated booster and everything. But man, oh man, I was I oh it was horrible. I, I was going crazy. I was having crazy dreams. I was I was waking up in uh in my in pools of my own sweat. I was I was shivering but completely overheating everywhere. It was awful. It was terrible. And this all happened when I got that new job that I will not say where, but it was stupid. It was dumb. Um and I'm no longer there. I, I was actually fired, which is, you know, c'est la vie. We're right back at square one once again. Uh, what happened with that is that um, two things happened. One, the job was an hour away. Uh, completely, you know, really hard to get to and really hard to to, to, to make it sure on time. Uh, make it on time. They wanted me at a, uh, specifically 8 and I would show up a couple minutes late. I will give them one time when I was like, it's rainy. And I was, I was, I was pretty late. I'm not going to lie. I was pretty late. But, you know, I did everything I could to just make it at least, like, a couple minutes. Maybe, you know, 8, 8 2 They didn't like that. And then, um, I thought I was completely fine. Even though I was coughing a little bit more, I thought I was like, okay, I'm just, uh, it's like a cold. Because I've stayed masked up and kept as much distance as I could from other people. But I was double masked and everything. Um, but I guess the ventilation there was ass because, you know. I was feeling a little ill one day, and I was like, oh, I think it was, I thought it was the weather change, because one day it went from like 80 degrees to, to 50, and then like one morning was like 43 degrees, and I was like, man, this sucks, I hate this, that thing right there, that right there, I hate that, um, turns out, uh, it wasn't that, but I didn't know that for a bit, so I, I showed up. You know, I was asked if I was feeling all right on Friday, and I was like, it's just, it's just coughing, you know, it's just, it is, it's what I do, because I often do cough a lot, or at least, you know, for a long time, that was just how my asthma was, um, and then the weekend came, and I was, I was going through it, I thought it was just, a, I was like, okay, it must be like a cold at this point, then my sweet and loving girlfriend came over, and, and she, uh, you know, she helped me, she took care of me a lot, and then she gets sick. She calls me when she heads home and she's feeling it. And I call out the Monday. That's actually the second thing that um, the job was like. Then I like that I called out on the Monday. But I was like, bro, I am not in any condition to be in any place. I could not move. I was glued to that to my bed behind me. I couldn't even I couldn't even do the thing where it's like, oh man, let me get up and play games. Now I was absolutely sleeping and drink getting up. All I did was get up. Maybe eat a couple bites of something, but mostly drink water and, and Gatorade and, and orange juice together. Not all three, but you know, orange juice and apple. Mm. Orange juice and ginger ale together. It was like, I was the godsend at the moment. 
and then she got tested and she was positive and I was like oh no that means that was me to giving it to you not to mention at this job I right before I got sick I was surrounded by a couple people who were like oh yeah oh man the illness is completely like it, it just like the vaccine for it just makes you sicker you know it's not even a big deal if you get sick and I was like in the moment I was like well fuck you because I know quite a few horrible things that have happened to people that I know and people that I've just had to read about but also in retrospect fuck that person completely it was it was a fucking nightmare that was terrible I don't want to do it again I don't want to wish on anyone else I'm <coughs> My sweet old partner and I are still going through the, the effects, the uh, aftermath of it. It sucks. But thankfully, we're here. But yeah, it was funny, because uh, like right after, like the day after, um, I had called out. I went in, and then I you know, did the day, and I went home. And then I got a call. They're like, yeah, so your, um, your, your entire project, your, your entire thing's been terminated here. And I was like, oh. I wasn't even sad. I was just like, oh, okay. I was I was doing everything I could to make it there, but you know what? Hey, it was already a shitty place. Maybe I'll be pushed into something much nicer, much better again. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this picture. Um, I actually drew this picture in the middle of being sick. I think that was the one, one of the few things I did do. Um, and you could see me like give up at the very end because I was gonna do a whole background and everything, try to do it for it. And I, I was like, nah, I'm, I'm done. Um, I was, I was, I was, I was, I was fighting for my life, honestly. But anyway, uh, I'm gonna go and try to eat something now. My appetite's not been the same. I've been eating less. I've lost a lot of weight since everything, but. I am still thankful to be here. I know uh, there's a lot of people who can't say the same, and a lot of people who've had their lives completely changed. And I, I am, I'm lucky. That's really all I can say. I'm very lucky. Um, don't really want to repeat this. I'm already knocking on wood. But anyway, I, I hope you all enjoyed this video. You take care. I'll be back to posting as much as I can. You, you guys do what you got to do. And I appreciate you being here. Take care.